welcome to its topic here i am presenting a unit test question paper of our school of computer science class 10 for syllabus only chapter 2 that is html first mcq the type of button that trigger a client side script when it clicked the correct answer would be button because submit button submit the form reset button reset the entries to initial state and script there was no any type of strip uh, script button number b the property is used to create rounded images to create any rounded images in a web page we use border property only so we'll use border radius not this border round or round number c specifies the space between border and the cell content it will be padding number d which of the following is not a value of the type attribute of ul tag it is oval number e the largest level of heading it is h1 number two fill in the blanks javascript is a scripting language that's widely used to add functionality and interact interactivity to the web page number b the container element include both on and off tag number c list are used to group related content together in a structured manner making content easy to read and understand number d will be image img and number e as the song have to replay automatically after it finishes so the attribute is loop then true and false a tag is used to create hyperlink, A means anchor, so it is true. Number B, HTML is a popular programming language. HTML is not a programming language, so it is false. Number C, by default order lists are marked as small a. It is false, by default order lists are marked as Hindu Arabic numerals as 1 to 3. Number D, CSS is used to control the style of a web document in a simple way. It is true. Number E, comments are ignored by the browser. It is also true. Then, one more question. Name anyone scripting language. It will be HTML or maybe JavaScript also. Number B, what is the full form of CSS, cascade style sheet? Number C, it is used to set the reverse ordering of the list item in an order list. It is reversed. Number D, what is the main tag to create table in HTML? It will be table. Number E, it allow you to divide the web page into several independent window. It is frames. Number 5, correct the following. Here, it came in earlier book. Uh, there will be one line of code or few lines of codes. There will be some mistakes. You have to correct the error. So, this kind of question also may come in board examination. So, here, first mistake is there is no image tag we have img tag so this is the first mistake and second mistake the inverted comma was not closed in alt attribute so these two are mistake in here number b in to give table name we write caption tag not name tag so here in place of name we will write caption number c iframe with iframe you we use attribute src not href so the attribute will be src here even i writing type writing wrong it will not scr it is src okay number d it will be ul type a and start three c means now for an order list suppose i want to start from c the list then we will count the position of c like a is one b two then c three so we'll write as three in start always we have to write numerical values not letters number e the mistake is here while we write css properties we don't give equal sign we give colon sign so colon after that thickness of the border then style of the border then the color name number six yes want to style html document using css you want to add style directly to an html tag so how he can do this he should use inline css in inline css we write the css inside the starting tag only then next one rohan created a table and he want to one that table border should be collapse collapse means the border should be joined together so how he should do this 
he should write this one border then this collapse property and the value should be collapse number c sanjay notice that he notice that his order list is marked with one two three but he want a b c how he can do that he should use the type attribute of order list and with the value a then the numbering will change to a b c number c sila inserted audio to her web page and she want to replay the audio automatically when it finish so what she should do she should use loop attribute for example audio src then song.mp3 loop bracket close audio close pranjal has created a form in html he want to accept multi line text input from the user what take he should use he should use text area and text area command should use within form tag means inside the form tag number 7 these are long questions two pictures of html already have in book you can write it from there what is the use of html formatting through formatting we can change the appearance that part you can write number c difference between ol and ul then how images are added in an html document after that list three types of text input control this will be single line multi line and password number f what is the use of target attribute it is used to specify where to open the link document and different values will be slash blank slash parent slash self and slash top after that uh, number 9 we have to write the html command to create this table here are the code you can pause the screen and see first we are creating the heading serial number name and marks after that we are creating the cells first inside tier we are writing the first line and next tier we are writing the second line and number b we have to create this list in html how we'll do it so first we will write the subject of our date part after that ol type 1 because the list numbering was 1 2 3 and first three element we will write inside third element we have another nested list so we again write ol type and this time numbering is abc so we will write a and after that the items after that we will close the ol and continue the previous list again so two more items after that ol will be closed so this is the answer of question number b and question c we have to write html command to create this form to create this form the command will be this one first we'll write form then fill set why we are using fill set because here you see this boxes are inside a group so we are creating this fill set and first username after that input type text then password again input type password date of birth input type date after that fill set close oh i forgot to write one line uh, this box check box for that after date after this line you will write again input type check box name and uh, bracket close after that you will write just save password i am writing it here in word document wait few me moment so after this line we'll add one extra line here we'll put br because we are going to next line and here we will write input type check box and we'll give name suppose name we are giving just x after that bracket close and here next line will go and here we will write save password so only this will be changes in that code whatever i have written in pdf 
here again I am going back to the PDF file after that we will create two buttons one button is submit button another button is this button means it will do some action to create the new account after that we will close the form tag body tag and HTML so these are the answers for the uh, these are the question of interest question paper along with the answers in your school there might be a bit different questions not this one from here just you'll get an idea what type of questions come from html so if you want the pdf copy of this uh, answers you can subscribe to my telegram channel the channel name is this one i'm opening it you can see it from there the challenge uh, channel name is it's rafik even with the similar name we have group also in group you can discuss your problem amongst yourself thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye